going on, everybody? It's Christian, Jake. We are CJ Kenny. I know it's been a while. Well, we've been busy. There's been a lot going on in all of our lives. So, um, but we're back to it. So we got a good video for you today, guys. Um, we're out here at Normandy Oaks Golf Course. It's actually the golf course is about two miles from where we live now, and not far from where we grew up and all that. So we've been here our whole lives, basically, but it's abandoned now. Um, so they have like soccer fields over here. Um, but other than that, it's just pretty much overgrown, and it's wild now. There's like turtles everywhere, there's toads everywhere, there's snakes in here. What else have we seen? A bunch of tadpoles. Um, so today we're going to be collecting some tadpoles. Um, most of we're just going to explore. Jake hasn't been here yet, so Jake's going to check it out. We're also um, releasing Miguel today. Miguel is with us, and we've had him for how long now, Zach? Uh, probably a month and a half. About two a months month and a half, two months. Yeah, for sure. Um, he's he's really cool looking now. He shed he shed a bunch of times. Um, he's done actually really well there. Zach, as he showed in a previous video, has been feeding him fish. He loved that cage, but um, we just didn't want him to get too big for it or anything, and just let him back to the wild. So that's what we're doing today. So we're gonna show Zach do that, and then we're gonna get on to the adventure. It's not going. Goodbye, Miguel. He's off. Oh, he's exploring. <laughs> That's awesome. Feeling a little emotional. All right. How do you feel, buddy? Even baby birds have to fly away from the nest someday. <laughs> I was into that. I was into that quote actually. But Basically, and it was so windy um, that you couldn't really hear anything I was saying, so I'm just gonna explain it really quick. Um, we were at the pond where we saw all the turtles the last week, and um, they were filling it in basically. They're just gonna fill it in with sand and uh, just get rid of the pond altogether. And like I said in the video, there's about 30 turtles in there that we know of, there could be more, but it's basically just a turtle sanctuary in there. So, what we wanted to do was relocate some of them if we could. We weren't sure if we'd be able to catch any. Um, but we um, had a couple different spots to put them. We had Jake's grandparents. Um, he wanted a turtle in his pond, so we're getting him to. Um, he has a really nice pond over there. And there was another pond about 500 feet from there. So we relocated some over there because they're going to turn this whole thing into a park or development. I'm not sure, but they're, I think what they're keeping the other pond. So we moved some over there. Um, but that, that, that's basically all we were going to do. And we were just here like picking up trash, things like that. Just kind of trying to make it like a, just a nicer area while it's here. So yeah, we were just hoping to save some turtles today. And I think we accomplished that. So we're over here at the end and uh... Zach's knee deep in mud, so that's a great start. Yo! I literally can't get out, dude. <laughs> we have to pull you out. Drake, help him. <laughs> this is like quicksand. Right. Don't, don't pull me down into the... Yeah, pull him, pull him towards you, Jake. <laughs> no! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Alright, so the first day when me and Christian came out here, we saw like hundreds of tadpoles. Uh, and this is... Oh! <laughs> this is a frog that just came out of tadpole form. He has a little bit of a tail left on the back. Actually, he's not a frog, he's a toad. I can't tell. I don't know. All frogs are toads or all toads are frogs. It's one of those. <laughs> Anyways. Um, yeah, this is the smallest toad slash frog I've ever seen. He's smaller than my fingertip. Uh, yeah, he's a cute little guy. 
Uh, we're gonna keep looking for more tadpoles because I think we're gonna try and convert Miguel's old tank into a little tadpole toad community. So stay tuned. Hey Jake. Let's get it. Magic. Let's take a gander. Oh wow. Yeah, it took some effort for one, but I think we got kind of a idea of how to catch them now. So uh, we got a better plan. But this guy, I mean, this guy is probably a couple years old. So he's probably been living here for a while, and it sucks that they're gonna fill this in on him, but. We're gonna try to find him a better place, either over there or at other ponds. So, he's a really amazing wild creature. So, we're gonna try to get him a really good app. I mean, you can see the algae on him. Like, this guy is beautiful. He's been through it. Yeah, it's like a painted turtle to me, obviously. So, this, guy's a, this guy is at least two years old, for sure. Like, um, comparing him to Walter, uh, Jake's turtle, at least two years old. Beautiful animal, I'm really happy with that. Let's get it. This guy's big. Ow, ow. This guy's big, bro. Ow. This guy's my punk. That's what I'm talking about. All right, got <laughs> Man up, buddy. Let's get it. That was awesome. Which one has less turtles? All right, so which bucket do you want, did you say? the other pond like I said uh, we caught six turtles I got five I think I got pretty lucky honestly and Zach caught one at the end so we had we couldn't leave before Zach caught one so he got one we're gonna release four of them in here really nice pond um, so the water's a lot more clear it's still kind of tainted from all the leaves and everything but there's plenty of places to bask the sun is on some of the pond for like the whole day so that's what they like um, so they're gonna do good here um, yeah, so we're going to release them and then we're going to bring two to Jake's grandpa's pond where they will be absolutely fantastic over here. So let's get it started. All right, there's one. Don't want to fall down and die. He's off. It's a lot deeper in here too, so I think we'll have plenty of room to swim and be good. You want to just pass me over here? So you're going to slip when I come down here before. Oh, big boy. Big boy. Yeah, so we caught six in about an hour, so I feel pretty good with that. Uh, we gotta leave though, but I think we'll come back another day. You're running here. So, um, yeah, I think we'll come back another day and try to get some more. Uh, I think it would just be sad to see that whole thing get filled up. And these guys have to run and hide through the neighborhood, so um, we got. Four in here and two in another good place, so we're doing good so far. All right, so we spent the day uh, over at the abandoned golf course catching all those turtles and stuff. We released them at that other pond over there, and now we're at my grandpa's house. Uh, he wanted some turtles, and so we thought, you know, why not take those turtles, give them a better home over here. He takes really good care of his pond. He's got, he had a frog in here. He's got a ton of koi and goldfish and stuff in here, so the turtles are going to do great in here. So we're just gonna put them right in, let's get started. 
Are you gonna find them? One. Nice. Say hello to the camera. That's pretty. He's in. Welcome, bud. Another small one. He's cool. He's hiding. There he goes. Both on the move. Awesome, dude. Yeah. We found the frog he was talking about. <laughs> Huge leopard frog. 